Top 20 Best Harem Anime, Surrounded by Sexy Girls The main character is surrounded by amorous women, but they are either oblivious, shy, or magically prevented from reciprocating their affection. The harem genre is everywhere, high school, horror, and science fiction all have examples. Harem anime typically involve a large cast of girls which fall in love with the main character, often a socially inept or shy male. That's the formula, and for the large part, anime has been reluctant to deviate from it in any significant way. You'd think that by now, they'd have figured out a way to actually make a good harem. Despite their popularity, only two harem anime sit above a 8.00 score on MAL, not counting sequels. But hey, that's not to say there aren't any gems to be found here. If you're after a good harem anime, this is great place to start. Number 10, Date A Live. What are the limits of your compassion? Would you love someone even if they caused planet-wrecking natural disasters? It's not like Shadow Itsuka really has a choice. In a world constantly under attack by alien spirits, Shadow has the ability to steal their power away and defuse their threat to humanity, by kissing them, of course. However, it must be a real kiss, not some lame old couple peck. In Day Day Live, building a harem is a survival tactic, and tamed spirits will join in battle against the new invaders. It's like a hybrid of Pokemon and Pacific Rim, but with teenage girls, and it's a harem anime? Sounds like a top combination to me. Number 9. Is this a zombie? The unlucky Aamu Akawa is murdered, only to be revived and enslaved by the beautiful necromancer Yuklewood Hellside. Then a freak accident gives him her powers, turning him into a zombie slash magical girl. Yes, with panty shots. Aamu battles the anti-magical girl forces of the Megalo as he fends off affection from classmates and vampire ninjas alike. But unfortunately for poor Aamu, there's no running from a harem anime. Number 8. Rosario to Vampire. Sukun Ono can't get into any high schools because of his awful grades, but Yukai Academy accepts him, whereupon he finds out that it's a school for monsters. He quickly finds a girlfriend in classmate Mocha aka Zhiaya, who wears a rosary that seals a powerful vampiric personality within her. As monster girls fall in love with Tsukun, he must juggle their affections and keep his own human status secret. This top supernatural harem anime is out of this world. Number 7. The Familiar of Zero. Louise Francoise L.E. Blanc de la Valier comes from a noble family of witches, but she herself is terrible at magic. When the time comes for the witches of Tristane Academy to summon their familiars, Louise summons Sato Hiraga, an ordinary Japanese boy. Sato must adapt to this magical new world, his role as a servant, and the advances of Louise's classmates. If Little Witch Academia didn't have enough nudity for you, this top harem anime might. Number 6. I don't have many friends, also known as Hagana, this popular harem anime draws inspiration from the creator's own teenage awkwardness. Kadoka Hasegawa is having trouble making friends at his new school because his grumpy expression and blonde hair make everyone think that he's a delinquent. He soon meets a girl who speaks to an imaginary friend, and together they form a club for outcasts. Predictably, the members are all girls and all fall in love with him. Number 5. False Love. 
Rakul Womanizer Senpai Ichishu is the heir to a powerful Yakuza family. When a rival American gang threatens his territory, he's promised to the daughter of their chief as a peace offering. The kids hate each other, of course, and things get more complicated when Raku's childhood friend whom he vowed to marry during childhood returns to make good on their promise. Many characters from Nisikoi are Mal user's best girls. Number 4. The World God Only Knows Ever wished your time playing visual novels could amount to something more? You might like the world God only knows. Kamikatsu Ragi is a kiss-hating otaku who rejects 3D women and their complicated emotions. Funnily enough, he's the best when you need help on clearing dating sim games. An accidental deal with a demon ropes him into the real dating scene, however. Spirits from hell have escaped and latched onto humans, and like Date A Live, they can only be defeated with a kiss. Oh, and Kama's got a battle royale collar that will kill him if he fails. No safe scumming in this harem anime. Number 3. Iskai no Sikashi Monogatari. What might explain this series' relatively high mal score compared to other harems is the unusually well thought out story. The girls in Iskai no Sikashi Monogatari are given more of a substantial reason to fall in love with Kenshi, the MC, and fall in love they all do. Even one of the characters' mom ends up smitten. It's a 45 minute per episode, 12 part OVA spin off of the Tenchi Muyu series, which features Kenshi a young boy that's transported from Earth and must pilot matches in order to find his way back. Number 2. High School DxD This has to be the best harem anime, with a male protagonist, ever. Breaking with tradition for an eki anime, the perverted male protagonist is killed in the very first episode. I know, Karma. But that's only the beginning of East Say Hi to Do's story. He's resurrected by senior student Rhea Scremery, who reveals that their school is full of supernatural creatures and she herself is a devil. Naturally, East Say's primary goal is to rise through the diabolic hierarchy to assemble his own harem, assuming he recognizes when his classmates are in love with him. Number 1. Aran High School Host Club Haruai Fujoka is a rare scholarship student at the prestigious Aran High School. After breaking an obscenely expensive vase, she is forced to join the host club to work off her debt. As it happens, Haruai easily passes for a boy, and quickly becomes popular with the host club's female clients as well as her male colleagues. Perhaps it's appropriate that the top harem anime has a protagonist that appeals to everyone. Yusuke no Sora You know how in eki anime producers often add a sister character and heavily imply that she wants to bone our lead but either never gets there or drops the old not blood related shtick. Don't you wish anime would just drop that pretense? Yeah, Yusuke no Sora. I shall say no more. <laughs>